Hello everyone, welcome back to my skincare video. And it's been a long time since I haven't do a skincare video and this time I'm going to do the perfect skincare routine for you oily faces out there. Okay, first of all, let's focus on cleansing. Now cleansing is very important if you're an oily skin because you know you have a lot of oils producing on your skin and you need to clean them thoroughly. So first of all, make sure you guys have an oil cleanser. But your friend, we're not even using makeup. Why are we using an oil cleanser? Because if we have an oily skin, we need to use oil cleanser to remove the oil. So it's basically oil versus oil. Now the oil cleanser that I have been using is simple hydrating cleansing oil. Now this oil cleanser is very simple to use and it's very soothing too on your skin. And again, oil cleanser is very important for oily skin out there because it will clean out all the excessive oils on our face. It will also clean out our sebums inside our pores. Hence, reducing the amount of whiteheads, blackheads, and also acne and pimples. For oil cleanser, I just use this two times a week and just at night only. And make sure you use the right technique for oil cleanser because it has a specific step and here are the steps. Next is face cleanser. For face cleanser, I had just started using the Cosrx Salicylic Acid Daily Gentle Cleanser. Now this one is very good too for oily skin because this cleanser has salicylic acid. Now salicylic acid is basically like a gentle exfoliator, a BHA type exfoliator which means it will clean inside your pores. Yeah, so basically oil cleansing is getting out the excessive oils and sebums inside your pores and then this one will also clean out your pores. And it is also suitable for reducing your whiteheads and blackheads. For exfoliator, because the product is in my toilet and I'm too lazy to walk to the toilet even though it's next to me, it is the Secret Key Lemon Sparkling Peeling Gel. So because the salicylic acid is a BHA, now this one is an AHA exfoliator because it will remove all your dead skin cell on the surface skin of your face. Which is also important too because we don't want to have clogged pores because clogged pores leads to whiteheads or blackheads or acne. All right, moving on to skincare. For the first skincare routine, of course, I will use a toner. I think toner is like a must for every skincare routine because after you cleanse your face, of course, your face will feel a little bit dry and the toner will help to hydrate your face back. I have been using the simple soothing facial toner forever I think because this toner is hydrating and the price is also good and cheap which I very like. Next we're moving on to serum or ampoule or boosters slash slash. So for serum I've been liking this Cosrx one, it is called Centella Aqua Soothing Ampoule. So the main focus of this serum or ampoule is it is hydrating and it will also calm your skin if you have redness or acne. And you might be thinking, Irfan, why is it so small? This is because I bought the trial one. The original one is a little bit pricey so I choose the trial one and the size is very well for me too because I just use this at night also, just buy the trial one. Next we have the Nature Republic Soothing and Moisture Aloe Vera Gel. So this one has also been with me since the starting of my skincare journey back in 2018. This aloe vera gel really 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 makes your skin very hydrated, not kidding. So this aloe vera gel is a humectant type moisturizer, which means it will make your skin hydrated. I always like to use this because it will always make my face very plump and like 
100% make my face fully hydrated. But I just use this one at night because uh, when you wear this, your face will start to be a little bit shiny like that. So you will have a reflection on your forehead and cheek. So that is why I just use this one at night, not in the morning. And lastly, for moisturizer, I bought myself the CeraVe Daily Moisturizing Lotion for normal to dry skin. So hold up. Yes, it mentioned that for normal to dry skin, but I think this one is my favorite of all of the moisturizers out there. First of all, because it has three essential ceramides and hyaluronic acid, meaning that it will hydrate your face and also repair your skin barrier, guys. So this is very important for the last step of your skincare routine. Can you see it? Yes. Now CeraVe is an emollient type moisturizer, meaning that it will repair your skin barrier. So that is why at the end of your skincare routine, you need to use the CeraVe. And it is also good for oily skin because it is lightweight and oil-free and it is non-comedogenic and won't clog pores. So that is why this is also suitable for oily skin out there. And lastly, for lip care, I just used the Clavu Nourishing Care Lip Sleeping Pack. Okay everyone, that is all my skincare routine tips and shares that I want to share to all of you guys. But just a disclaimer, skincare routine doesn't work out for everyone, so just try and test which one suits for you. So if you guys have any questions regarding oily skin type or also to any skincare products that I have here or anything else, you guys can put them at the comment section below. Don't forget to click like and also subscribe and share this video too. Thanks for watching.